morning people and diggers now I have been so looking forward to coming out today I don't know why but it's nothing new because I always do don't I every Saturday I'm always looking forward to coming out but especially I'm because the weather is windless and you know if you're a videoer having no wind is fantastic so anyway we're back in the hammy field I'm feeling optimistic today I would like a George the Third silver, I'd like a half a crown, I'd like um, any sort of hammered coin again, <laughs> and um, <laughs> a, a Saxon strap end. <laughs> yeah, that's what I want today. So wish me luck. Well, I've come out with my Ami combination again, which is the AT Max and the Viper, new AT Max Viper coil. But we've got something exciting today because the landowner, you see, has removed. All the grass, the topsoil, can you say he's put it up there? I don't know what he's doing here, but he's doing something. But he's removed all this and he said we can have a dibble on it if we want to. So I'm going to dibble dabble because that's you don't get opportunities like that very often up here. Well, first find's not quite what I was expecting. It's like a soda siphon um, optic thing. But we are digging in front of a pub and it's been a pub for 500 years. So I don't think that's 500 years old, but it makes sense. Yeah, there it is, my first old one. This is good, this, this is good, this is good. I mean, can't really tell what it is yet or if it's got anything on it because I haven't got my glasses on. But I'm just going to stick them in my bag. Oh, this is all exciting, this muddy bit. What's in the clump? Now, it was an 88 signal, which is quite high. It's not high enough for a, what I would say is a cartwheel. It's not low enough for a, a big penny. Ooh, ooh, but it is a coin. You can see it. I can see it. What is it? Is it let's say it's quite big. It's quite big. It is. <gasps> big reveal, big reveal. Um. I was saying it's a George third copper from the thickness. Oh yeah. This is great, this on this like, landowner's just come out and gone in gone in to make us a cup of coffee. It's like detected in luxury. Oh, 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 oh it's in the clump, it's in the clump, but he dump. This was a nice crispy signal. So if you can see anything. Come on. Come on, we always say, come on, I wanted a queen, I was saying to Kev this morning, we could be fine Queen Anna or anything here, with this top layer took off. Where's it gone? <gasps> Did you see what I could see? Oh, already. <laughs> Jubilee silver sixpence. Oh, brilliant. Oh, look at it. It's nice, that, isn't it? You see, it's like she's got like a little crown on top of red. Oh, fantastic. <laughs> oh, you know, this has got to be the best silver permission we've had for ages. Just popping up everywhere. Yeah, it's not charged a third, and it's not an hammered, and it's not an half a crown. Or a Saxon strap end, but I still love it. I love it, love it. Mwah. Go into my silver box. Oh, yeah, you always got to love it. You see, when you found a silver early on like that, it sort of pressures off to find anything, and the rest of the day is just fantastic. And another one. Is that, is that, the, is that the imprint? Yep, yep, I thought I'd just spill then. <gasps> They're not very deep, these. This is great. It's like I've been on plough, I suppose, isn't it? Okay, well, now I've had a silver, just everything else is just a bonus. That's quite thin, that. I think that's probably an early George third again. I well, just filmed all the dig for this one, didn't have my camera on. But it's um, another George third with a sort of... Well, it's got a funny shaped edge on it. Someone must have filed it down or something. It looks like a sort of George third 50p. Is it? 
It's a little funny the shape, that, isn't it? I'll have to investigate that in a bit. Might be a token. Well, I'm coming back in my grass field now. I like I like that plough. It's got a lot of potential, but you can't beat a bit of grass. So I put my detector in all metal mode because this feels quite quiet now. So I want to try and get as maximum depth as I can. So I've put it in all metal mode. And I'm digging iffy signals as well. But this one was a 66. Because I don't know what Saxon strap end's coming at. And there could be some at Saxon here. Me and Kev just had a long conversation about where Saxon gold's buried. Anyway, I've opened it up and it's gone to a bit higher. Oh, it's a big bit of lead. It's a bit of Saxon lead. Well, it could have been a strap end, could it? I'd just like to say to everybody as well, a really, really big massive thank you. You're all legends because yesterday I got to 19,000 subscribers. And I'm absolutely over the moon. I can't even believe it. I remember thinking, sat, sitting there once years ago thinking about tw having 20,000 subs. And it just seemed completely impossible. And now I'm so close. I'm only that far away. It's unbelievable. So thank you very much. It's made my weekend. So say that's something nice. Right, okay, let's do a live dig. Oh, it's a ring thing! <laughs> I can't go a day without ring thing. Why is there so many ring things? I always get one. Just one ring thing per dig. How strange. Never mind. <laughs> ring thing it is. Ooh, look! Does it look silver to you, that? What you have? Please be silver, be silver. Don't be a penny, don't be a penny. Oh, oh it fell off. It fell off. Is it, is it, don't be a penny, don't be a penny. Don't be a penny. What is it? Oh, 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 what's that then? It's, it's, like, it's got some strange dude's face on it, look. You see it, Kev? Is it a strange dude's face? There. Yeah. Oh, what is it? Oh, it's 20, it's French. I think it's French. 20 summits. Hey, hey, that's all right, isn't it? Ha 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 ha. Bonjour, mademoiselle. Ich bin. No, that's German, isn't it? Um, I can't think of it. I am silver in French. Je, je suis silver. <laughs> Domus, Domus 29, you'll know what I'm saying now, won't you? Je suis le argent. I think that's it, I think I've done it. I am silver in French. Je suis la, le argent. <laughs> oh, well, sorry, Domus, I've just looked at it more clearly, and it's Italian. It says Italian, and it says on it, uh, 1908. So, um, you know what that means, don't you? It means a fa- a Roman in the hole, a Roman in the hole. Do you think this is Roman? I'm saying that I'm a posh voice, so you know what I'm saying. I think I found a little bit of Roman. <laughs> I always find different currencies from different bits of the world. I've had Napoleon, I've had American things, I've had French things, and now I've got a bit of Roman in the hole. <laughs> We have two silvers now. I, I, I said to Kev earlier, you know, I said, I think I'm going to get five silvers today. And a Saxon strap end. Bzz, bzz, oh, oh. I think, don't think that's a... Is it a Vicky? Be a Vicky or a George V, I should imagine. Oh, well, I'm having a great day. No wind or anything. It's fabulous. I, I, I love that. I've had a lovely Vicky with a little jubilee head. I like jubilee heads. And um, 
Yeah, there she is, it's Victoria. And now, now that Italian bloke. It, 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 is, it does mean. It does mean that I found some at Roman. I, I'm over the moon with that, you know. I am really, really. I mean, that's over 100 years old and it's Italian and I don't know how it's got here. I love finding different. So I've had an American one cent large over there. I've had a hammy down there and now I've just had an Italian one. And I've had a bit of um, a Vicky in, the, in that mud bit. Oh, that's great. I'm having such a great day. I just love it, love it, love it, love it, love it, love it, love it. There he is, little fathead. I'm looking for his little silver friend. Yeah, come on, Georgie, where's your silvers? Because I've had loads of you out of here, but I've not had any silvers, George the Third. I mean, I would have liked an Edward the Seventh silver as well. That would be fantastic. I'd like anything today. I'm in that sort of mood where I just love, I love everything today. Everything's fantastic. Just an old Saxon door latch. They did well with the metalwork in them days, didn't they? <laughs> That's not proper gold, it's just a gold milk bottle lid. But I'm uh, digging lower signals now because I've had some nice silvers. I'm going for very, very low, so I'm even digging 40s. Might have a wander over into that. I'm getting the feeling to go over to go over that way. I don't know why. So found a nice signal on my way over. That's in there. Oh, 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 oh. oh, can you see that? Can you see it? It's like a little ball with a smiley mouth. Hello, do you think I'm George the Third Silver? I might be, I've got a smiley face. <laughs> Come on, what is going on? It's thin though, it could be another hammered. Could be, couldn't it? Oh, go on, break it open. Oh, it's Mill's Edge. It's a Mill's Edge. That's three. I had a premonition I was going to five five. Oh, go on, what are you going to be? What are you going to be? What are you going to be? Oh, it's so exciting. It is. Uh, it's a sixpence. <laughs> an old dead one that that's i've said it before and you were all laughing but that's the head she had before she died that one oh that's great that's three now then three silvers you think i make it to five with my premonition look you see you there with that veiled head it'll be about 18.99 that one oh that's a nice condition that as well oh i'm well chuffed let's see what the date is i can see it it's like a disco this video isn't it get, get my dad's seat pants on again. Uh, this date is... I can't see it. It'll be 18 I think, probably. Oh, fantastic! Three little silvers in the hole. Happy, 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 ah. <gasps> But now, people keep asking me why I'm finding so many coins here. The answer is this. The field is next to a church, which is 500 years old. Church fields are always full of money. And it's also next to a pub, which is 500 years old. And pubs are always full of money as well. So that's, that's the, the answer to your question. Hey, well chuffed with them. Well chuffed. I think that's a dog tag or something, isn't it? It's a bit crusty on the crack to up the middle. I haven't done that. Yeah, I think it's probably a dog tag or something. We'll see when we get home and clean it. Well, this one nearly blew my ears off. Now, it could be rubbish or it could be a big silver. <laughs> yeah, well, there you go, you see. I thought it was a bit big. But it could have been a big half crown. But uh, you've got to dig them, haven't you? So I just dug to the centre of the earth for this. I thought it was a George III. But then I looked, and I think I think it's him that has a grape head. You know, he has an hairstyle with grapes on. Um, it's a token. I'm not sure where he's from. But wait, have you got your water, Kev, yet? Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, spray it on there. 
sure it's a grey pet. I've not had a grey pet for years. It's definitely somewhat different to normal. I'll give it a bit more. You see that? Like, he's like got a big bun at the back of his head. There. Oh, it is a grey pet. Now I've seen that. It's a token. Um, oh, where's it from? Might be Birmingham or somewhere. You spray it on the back there, see if my brain will kick into gear. I can't. It's years since I found one. Oh, yeah, that's a good find, that. like it. Look, you can see it there. Grey ped. Right, I'll find it, that what it is. I think it's a Birmingham token of, of some sort, but, yeah, I really like that. Now, this is interesting. I've not rubbed the front off it yet. The back of it looks like that, so is that some sort of pin badge? So let's rub the front off and see what's there together. That might be nothing. Uh, I'm getting some. Well, it seems to have a bit of colours inside it. I don't think it's uh, Saxon, but it might be. Well, I don't think Saxons had backs like that, did they? No. I like that. I think that'll clean up nice, that. It might be a train wheel or something. I keep digging these daft nails up. Don't know what they are. Just heard Kev shout over there. Bloody window catch. <laughs> Must be having the same as me, yeah. Anyway, I don't want any more of them. Right, last hole of the day. You know, it's like the first hole, last hole. <laughs> oh, it's out, whatever it is. It's knocked it off. Oh, it's there it is. It's a... Uh... Oh, it's a little button, but... Oh, it's a nice one, isn't it? Oh, look! Oh, what a pretty button. Oh, that's beautiful, isn't it? Is it modern? Look, might be look a bit modern to me, that. But it's got a picture on it. I mean, that makes a difference, doesn't it? What does it, what does it look like? Let me turn it around a bit. Oh, it's nice, that, isn't it? Oh, yeah, I love that. Right, I'm off home now. I've had a fantastic day as always. Going back to work on Monday. I've just just really got into um, not working or working from home, should I say. And now it's ended and I've got to go back. So I'm gonna have to, I've, I've forgotten how to get ready in like normal work clothes. I, I'm all right getting ready for metal detecting, but getting ready to, you know, do teaching. I, I was, I'm going to have to sort of sort my clothes out night before and that. I won't remember what to do. Anyway, I'm going to have to go home because I'm doing a charity walk at the minute for Dementia UK and I've got to walk 100 kilometres in March and um, so I've got to go out every day. I did 14.2 yesterday, so today I'm just going to do five because um, it all adds up, doesn't it? So you might see some of my little walk videos out, what I'm doing for Dementia UK. I'm going to donate all the money from the videos to it as well. So um, if you want to donate anything, I'll put a little link in, in the comments. Um, and um, that's it then. Like a bird on a tree I'm just sitting here I got time, it's clear to see From up here, the world seems small We can sit together It's so beautiful, you and me to watching my YouTube channel. If you enjoyed this video, please don't forget to subscribe. If you want to follow me on social media, you'll find me on Facebook, on Digadon Facebook group. 
find me on Instagram, at Diggerdorm. And if you there's my little egg, just press that, subscribe, you won't miss any videos. So thank you very much, see you soon. Sometimes you need to go.